Hey everybody, it's me, the 13th Wolfman, and this is another Top 5. In, uh, in honor, I guess, of the release of The Dark Knight Rises, this Top 5 is going to be a Batman Top 5. Now, I've made it clear that I, I like the Nolan Batman movies, but I don't like some of the some of the stuff that he's done with the with the mythos in the universe some things that he refuses to do so I want you know Warner Brothers is gonna basically reboot the series and I wanna know what what are the top five things you wanna see in the reboot here's my top five uh, in no particular order, by the way. I mean, th this is just the top five. Uh, I want to see a Batman with the muscle beach physique. You know, um, if you read the comics, Batman's like huge, broad chested, and it's got kind of a tiny waist. And none of the Batmans, going all the way back to Adam West, and even before Adam West, going back to the guy that did the serial, the two guys that did the serials back in the 40s. Um, no one's ever had that classic Batman look from the comics or the cartoons. And I, I would like to see that. I'd like to see that, you know, n number four, the criminals. I, I want to see more... I'm I'm through with the Joker. I could never see the Joker again for the for the rest of my life, and I'd be fine. Um, the Riddler's okay. No more Catwoman. I mean, come on. The the villains I want to see: Man Bat, Clayface, Killer Croc, um, the Creeper. Things like that. I want to see more interesting. You know, Two Face is cool, but he's been done twice now. So, um, number three, I want the toys to be sleek again. The thing I didn't like about the Nolan movies is that the Batmobile, the Bat Pod, and the Bat in this one, in the newest one, um, they all look clunky. You know, the 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 Batmobile just looks like a giant armored tank type of thing, and it doesn't have sleekness to it. It doesn't have class. It doesn't have the Batman look. It just looks looks like someone just threw together a bunch of parts in the garage and said, "Hey, here you go." You know, same with the Batpod. I mean, as cool looking as it is, it just doesn't seem like um. It just I don't know. It doesn't seem like like a like it, I don't know it's not like a motorcycle it's just this weird I don't know it just doesn't look good to me I, but I do understand I do like Batman Begins The Dark Knight and The Dark Knight Rises I do like these three movies they're just little elements that have always bugged me in the in this universe um number two Let's get rid of the goofy, grovelly voice of Batman. I mean, and let's get him back to being a playboy. In all of the Nolan stuff, I never really conceived of uh, Bruce Wayne being a playboy. You know, I mean, he was here and there and on occasion, but you never really got the playboy, the playboy vibe, you know, like he's supposed to be. And the grovelly voice, I mean, so he talks like normal. And then when he's bad, he's like, I am It's like, come on. You know, you could achieve the same effect by just talking deeper. You know, go from go from here to go, go down to here. I am Batman. My voice doesn't sound as grovelly, but it's just a little lower. I mean... And number one, number one, what was the one thing that I would like to see different? I'm not really sure. Uh, I, 
I do like it when they when they introduce more of the Batman family, you know. I actually liked Batman Forever. I actually liked Batman and Robin because we got to meet Robin and Batgirl. Um, maybe maybe not introduce Batgirl yet, but you could definitely introduce Barbara Gordon, you know. And somewhere down the line introduce her as as Batgirl, but something like that. Just just give a wink or or a or a nudge to a future Batman family member, I guess. Well, this is my top five. I want to hear and see your top five, so please, do the comments. I, I really would like to see more video responses. I mean, comments are cool and everything, but I'd like to see what people are thinking. So video responses are, are welcome. Um, I'm the 13th Wolfman, and I'm on the prowl.